Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing my second year university haul. Um, there is not going to be as much stuff as there was last year because I've not been able to shop as much because I'm going into second year and I already have a lot of the stuff that I need. <laughs> Unfortunately, because I absolutely loved shopping last year, like shopping for first year is the most fun thing ever. But obviously this year I'm moving into a little house um, and I'm ne I've needed to get some stuff for my new room and yeah, and I've also got a few stationary bits not much because I still have some stuff from last year also I still need to do a bit of stationery shopping um, but this is mainly home stuff from Ikea and H&M, Primark, things like that so yes, carry on watching if you want to see what I got so I'm going to start off with stationery because they're like the little few bits that I've got first um, basically I went to Paper Chase and they had a three for two on and my favourite notebooks were there. Um, this sounds so weird. I think I've mentioned these before in like one of my college videos. Um, I have like a favourite notebook from Paper Chase, which is odd, but they had a three for two on. So I was like, because I use them all the time and I run out of them pretty quick, I thought I'd get three. Because <laughs> obviously then I get one for free. So these are my favourite notebooks. So I got the bag. <laughs> I'm only going to show you one, but I did get three. Um, seven fifty each and they just look like this. And they have like the sections in, they have four sections. And I just think that this notebook is really good because the sections actually have a good amount of paper in. The amount of notebooks that you get that have not got enough paper in each section is ridiculous. Like I don't understand. But this one does and it's perfect so I can keep, even though we have like five modules, um, some of them we don't start till like later on. So um, when we've finished another module. So I only ever really have four modules going on at once. Probably less than that. So this is fine. So this is like a section for each module. Perfect. So when I was in Asda the other day, I had a little scope around the stationery and they have some quite good stuff. And these are my favourite pens. They're about £5, but you get a big pack of them, which is so good. These are the Paper Make, Paper Mate Ink Joy Ultra Smooth Ink Ballpoint. I am like so obsessed with pens and these are my favourite ones. They look like this and they're just my favourite. I love them and I was so happy when I found a big pack of them. Also, if you love stationery, I got this, which is a pack of highlighters and these are my favourite highlighters, these middle ones. And this was about £3 something for all of these highlighters and these are the best highlighters. Like if you want really good highlighters, these are the best. I've not tried these ones or these ones but these middle ones are what the ones I always buy in a little pack so the fact that they come all together with loads of different types just made my day like literally I was so so happy when I found this like oh so now let's go into bedding so I'm going to start off with H&M um so this year obviously I have a theme <laughs> like last year my theme last year was like hot pink grey and white and you kind of do forget about your theme half through the year but I've started with a new thing this year and it's light pink and kind of like a nice grey colour and white so it's a little bit classier than bright pink <laughs> um, and this year I have a double bed so I can't keep the same duvet that I had last year so I've had to buy a new duvet and I've bought some more pillows as well and I just got those from Asda because I got a duvet from Ikea last year and I had to replace it with an Asda one because it was so freaking thin and just not very good quality. So I got the Asda one and I loved that one so I just got a double one of them. I think it was like £14 which is so good for a double duvet and it was like Tog 13.5 or something like that. I don't know, really know about duvets. <laughs> um, yeah, so I went to H&M and they have the best homeware in there. Like... I forget which hitch number I went to, I think it was in Westfield in London when I was there on holiday, well like on like a little trip away um, and I went into the Westfield there and into Westfield there and they had an H&M home usually it's just like online, I think they actually do have one in Edinburgh we've been and it's really really good um, it's quite small though, <laughs> H&M home needs to expand because I love it and I keep seeing Zara home everywhere and I love Zara home too and I love how that's expanding anyway <laughs> Um, so in H&M, this is what kind of inspired me for my theme. Um, this is the bedding I got and it's like, it's kind of like a purpley light pink. My lighting's gone so funny. It's kind of grey today anyway, but anyway. Um, <laughs> this is the double duvet and this was £30. But I thought I'd get a really good quality duvet cover. And then I'd get a cheap one from Primark for when this is in the wash. Um, you know, so it's not too expensive, it's not like I bought two. Um, and this comes with two pillowcases as well. And it's like a light dusty pink. And it kind of looks a bit purple on camera, but it is more pink. But I just love this. I thought I'd have a completely plain bed cover and then have like a really nice throw, which I'm yet to find. 
and some patterned cushions. So this is why I've gone for plain rather than like a funky pattern. Then from H&M I've got two of these cushions and I also got some cushion insides from Ikea. And these are like 50 by 50 and they're just like this pattern. <laughs> and I thought with the bed set they would look absolutely gorgeous together. So that's like my little theme going on and I freaking love these cushions. I got two and they're nice and big um, and they're really good quality and these were literally £3.99. So good. I also, this is in this bag, my mum got me this from Fenix and it's a light up K. Isn't that just the cutest little thing? <laughs> um, yeah, it lights up and I'm going to put this on my desk on my dressing table. I did buy a dressing table from Ikea the other day to put in my room because I have the biggest room in the house. Thank you Zoe and Matt, thank you. <laughs> um, so I think I have room for a little dressing table. If not then I'll take it home and put it in my room now um, and replace it with my dressing table. Anyway, um, it's wide. I'll try and insert a picture if I can find one. It's got some lovely drawers. It's got like a little pull out drawer. It's actually a desk but I'm going to use it as a dressing table obviously because we've got a desk in our new room. However, it's quite small and for all of my makeup, if you've seen my makeup collection, you will know I've got quite a lot of makeup so I need something separate and I'd quite like to keep them separate anyway because last year in my uni room, my makeup kind of got in the way of where I could work because um, obviously there wasn't that much room. So from Asda, to go in the middle of these two cushions, I got um, this fluffy cushion which is again grey and the kind of same kind of grey as these so I think they'll look really nice together. I don't know if they will. <laughs> I think they will anyway. And this with this colour, I thought it looked really, really pretty. And this is the softest cushion you've ever felt in your life. Like, I felt this and I was doing it, I was like, I need you. Like, <laughs> I think the labels come off it, but I think it was about £8 um, for a big soft cushion, which is going to annoy the hell out of me because I'm going to constantly be, like, brushing it. Um, yeah. Now for Primark, like I said, I got the kind of more expensive bed set and then I got a cheaper one just for when that one's in the wash. So this is the bed set that I got, literally just light pink. It's pr practically the same colour as this one, although this one's a little bit like darker. Anyway, it's practically the same, so it'll still match like with these cover these pillows and stuff. It's just a double bed set with some, I don't think it comes with pillowcases. It does! <laughs> uh, I went and got pillowcases as well. This was just 10 quid, um, just for when that one's in the wash. Um, I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> for like bed sheets on the bottom of my bed, I got this patterned one, which is like this. And I thought with like this, look how cute that is. <laughs> so this is going to be like my bottom sheet. I also got a plain grey one, I think. Yeah, so I got a plain grey one as well so I can mix and match, but I really like this pattern one. I also got some more pillowcases. I didn't realise that bed set came with pillowcases, but I got some pale pink ones and then this patterned one. My brother got this for me when we were down south seeing family. We went to this cute little um, kind of farm shop with a little like coffee shop and things and they had these and they had like a whole like a range of them. My brother was like, which one do you want? I'll get you one for uni. So this is the one that I got and it says Bake, Stir, Sprinkle, Mix. And if you know me and Zoe, <laughs> we bake all the time. Like that is, baking and drinking is the main things we do at uni. So <laughs> I remember last year being like, oh, I don't think I'll bake at all. We bake all the time. <laughs> um, this was 4 99 My mum got me this, which is which says, if the glass is half empty, there is room for more wine. <laughs> and this is hopefully gonna go in the kitchen if the other guys like it. Um, <laughs> but it's really, really cute. I don't know how they can't like it. It's just simple. Um, yeah. Okay, let's go into Ikea now. <laughs> um, this is basically because I freaking hate ironing and I'm not very good at it and I always get Zoe to iron for me. <laughs> One, because I am awful at putting up and down the ironing board, which sounds ridiculous. I get myself in such a tiz. Like, I... I put it up fine even though it like squeaks horribly and then trying to put it down is like the bane of my life and then when I iron I end up putting more creases in things and it's just a nightmare but sometimes like when I'm wearing a shirt like this um like in the morning for a lecture if those like Matt and Zoyan up um I don't want to be going downstairs with the noisy like ironing board trying to like iron and stuff and what if it gets late at night and I'm like oh my god I need to iron that shirt for tomorrow well <laughs> I got this from Ikea which is literally 
a mini stand up iron board so I can stand this on my desk or on the floor and iron because I do have an iron from last year that I never used this is only £4 and I just thought to keep this in my wardrobe just in case I need to iron a bottom of a shirt that's a bit creased so the next thing my ne my room at university this year um, I've only actually seen it like twice but it's quite big, <laughs> um, not huge, I'm not saying it's like a mansion, it's not a big house at all, I just have the biggest room and there's quite a lot of like floor space so I wanted some sort of rug to put down even like next to my bed just to make it look nicer because it's kind of like a scratched wooden floor, you'll see when I do my room um, tour it's kind of all scratched and not the best so I got a rug from Ikea and this is the rug, it's really going to be hard to show you um, but this was £22 and it's like this and you might think oh that's awful I absolutely love it like literally it's got like tassels on and yeah it's like grey and white which is my theme obviously it does look really nice when it's out like in Ikea it was in the shop and I was like oh my god I love that and I'd seen it on the website so yeah I just got this just to kind of I don't know make my room look a bit nicer I got two wine glasses because me and Zoe barely have any wine glasses um, I only got two because even though we would have got four, oh, <laughs> they cling together, Zoe will be happy about that. <laughs> Every time we get like drunk, we always clean our glasses together and see if they work well, and these do. <laughs> these are literally a pound each, and I just got two because I know that we'll probably be trying to find some cute ones somewhere, so I just got two to keep us going for like the first few weeks. I then got some more fairy lights. These are Ramster. I had these last year, and my plan is... I already have quite a few fairy lights to be honest, I'm kind of a fiend for fairy lights. Anyway, um, my plan is to get fairy lights on my big kind of white wall and hook them around like command hooks and then hang pictures off them. Um, so I got another pack of fairy lights, I don't know if these will be long enough to be honest, I'm hoping they are going to be longer than the Primark ones because they won't work. Um, but yeah, I got more fairy lights so yeah. I then got a bath mat. like. Obviously because we're sharing a bathroom this year and I didn't know what colour they'd all want and I just thought we're going to need a bath mat like we're not going to, I don't know if the place comes with a bath mat so I just got this kind of like teal one. So I hope you like it guys because yeah but it's really soft. <laughs> um, I just thought we'd need a bath mat and we can always go out and get a different one but I like this one even if I just use it for myself like this is nice and it's kind of like this like bobbly material and it's really really super soft and I love the colour teal, it's really nice. And the last thing, <laughs> you may find this ridiculous but I saw this mag here and you know when you see things and you're like oh my god that was going to be such a good idea and then you bring it home and you're like mm, <laughs> I probably won't use it. Anyway this is from Ikea and it's basically you can use your laptop on your knee with it and my laptop gets really warm, my MacBook does because like obviously it's not really got, I don't think it's got vents in it and if it does it's not very good so if I'm like doing work or something it gets really hot on my lap also I feel like that's not very good for it so I can put this, when I'm working on my bed I can use this on my bed and then also downstairs if I'm working Um, this is just like bright pink and you can put it on your lap and it's kind of like hooked so you can work with your laptop on your lap without it being at a different angle like this kind of makes it at like a slanty angle and I just thought it was quite a good idea even if I don't use it I think it's good to have I probably will use this on my bed though because I feel like that is a really good idea okay guys so I know that haul wasn't as big as last year um but I still really hope you enjoyed it and if you want any more university videos let me know and I will be doing a university room tour this year once we're settled in we're moving in on Saturday um which is so exciting this is Monday today um yes I can't wait to move in I'm really really excited to get back into uni and to do freshers week as not a fresher and just go back and have a great time and get drunk so yeah I really hope you enjoyed this video everyone um let me know below if you've got any questions or requests or anything like that like the video and subscribe if you enjoyed and if you're new don't forget to check out my last year's university video um and my makeup tutorials yeah so thanks for watching everyone I really hope you enjoyed the video bye